Hello, today we are going to train your English voice to use relative clauses. Clauses are parts of sentences. Relative clauses tell us more about a noun. When we talk about people, we use who or that. Have a look at sentence one. The man who or that lives next door is a dentist. So in this sentence, we are talking about a man, so that is a person. So we can use the word who or that. Both words are correct. This is a relative clause. It is telling us more about the man. Which man is a dentist? The man who lives next door. Sentence two. A dentist is someone who or that looks after our teeth. Okay. So once again, we are talking about a person. We are talking about a dentist. So we can use the word who or that. Both are correct. Let's have a look at one more example. Jack, who is 63, has just retired. We are talking about a person, Jack. So I chose to use the word who. And this is the relative clause because it is telling us more about Jack. When we talk about things, we use that or which. So have a look at sentence one. My tooth, which is aching, will be fixed today. Now we are talking about a tooth, so you can use the word which. And this is the relative clause. It is giving us more information about the noun, about the tooth. Sentence two. I don't like teeth that are aching. So here we are talking about teeth, that is the noun, and we can use the word that in that sentence. And this is a relative clause. Let's have a look at one more example. This is the house which Jack built. This is the relative clause in this sentence because it's it is telling me more about the house. It is the house that Jack built. House is the noun. Excellent job with relative clauses. Well done. Goodbye.